Virtuoso Alignment Brightest Star and North Level Align A 336-second guide by All-Star Telescope The Virtuoso line of telescopes feature motorized altitude azimuth mounts, often shortened to Alt-Az mounts. These Alt-Az mounts are go-to enabled, meaning that they can automatically find celestial objects for you. For this automatic function to work, the mount requires alignment before use. You'll need your Virtuoso Telescope System, the SynScan Pro app, available for Android, iOS, Windows, and Mac OS. For the purpose of this video, we'll be using the Android app. It may also be helpful to have a star map, physical or app-based if you are unfamiliar with navigating the night sky. Let's begin. Use the mount's bubble level to confirm that the system is level. Power on the mount. Open your phone, tablet, or computer's Wi-Fi settings and connect to the Virtuoso Mount's Wi-Fi network. The name should generally appear as SynScan underscore, followed by four characters. Once connected, open the SynScan app and select Connect at the top of the screen. Once connected, you can use the on-screen arrows to move the mount remotely. These smaller arrows are used to control the mount speed. The current mount speed is displayed here, one being the slowest and nine the fastest. Use higher speeds when moving to a star, and then as you get closer, lower the speed for more precision. The directional pad arrows can also be toggled on and off by tapping the double arrowhead in the bottom left corner. We're now ready to align the mount. On the main screen, select Alignment. You'll be presented with a variety of alignment methods. For the purposes of this video, we'll be focusing on North Level and Brightest Star Alignment. North Level and Brightest Star Align are a balance of ease and accuracy. Both methods use two stars to align, but for North Level Align, the mount goes to both stars on its own and will require you to verify that the object is centered. Brightest Star Align requires you to find the first star and then the mount will find the second. We'll go over North Level Alignment first. Start by selecting North Level Align. Select the first and second stars it will use for alignment. Tap Begin Alignment. The app will then prompt you to level the telescope and point it north, also known as home position. This is done by slightly loosening the horizontal and vertical mount screws just enough to move the mount by hand. Moving the telescope to horizontal position, parallel to the ground. Use a bubble level or leveler app on your phone to confirm it is level. Point the telescope tube towards true north, not magnetic north. You can use a compass app or the headings on the SynScan Pro app for orienting north. Retighten the mount screws. The more precise you are with these two things, the more accurate the mount will be. Tap on the star to confirm when you are in home position. The mount will then, on its own, move towards the first target star. Once the mount stops, the app will ask you to manually center the star in your eyepiece. While moving the mount with the on-screen arrows, center the star first in your red dot finder, then in your eyepiece. Remember to slow the speed of the mount down as you get closer to the target star. A star map or a star map app can be helpful in confirming which star to look at. Once you have the object centered in your view, notice the red blinking arrows. These arrows indicate the presence of backlash in the mount, and you will not be able to proceed until the backlash is removed. Remove the backlash by tapping the red arrows until the red is gone. Tap on the star, and the mount will proceed to the next object. Repeat the same process as with the first star. Line the star up with the red dot finder, and then with the eyepiece. Tap on the star again and your mount is now aligned. Now for Brightest Star Align, the steps are very similar to North Level Align. After selecting Alignment, select Brightest Star Alignment. You will then need to select the two target stars. For the first target star, the app only lists the brightest and easiest to find stars that are currently above the horizon. Once both stars are selected, tap Begin Alignment, and then you will be instructed to manually center your eyepiece on the first star. This can be done in two ways. The first way is via the on-screen arrows. Use the arrows to slew the mount over to the first star and line it up with your red dot finder. After, center it in your eyepiece. Don't forget to reduce the mount speed as you approach the star. The second way can be done by slightly loosening the vertical and horizontal mount screws, and then moving the telescope by hand to the general area of the star. Retighten the screws. Then use the app's arrows to center the star. 
Once the star is centered, remove the mount's backlash by tapping the red flashing arrows. Tap the star. The mount will then travel to the second star on its own. Like before, you will then be required to center it in your red dot finder first, and then your eyepiece. Once the second star centered, tap on the star. The mount is now aligned.